How is it? It's only in English. Hey there folks and welcome to another episode of A Healthy Dose of Fran. Today I'm doing a new K-pop reaction video for you all to someone who I recently found out has done, uh, has gone on to do a US uh, debut, I think, possibly, I don't, I don't really know much about it. But the person I'm reacting to today is actually a previous member of Girls' Generation. I think she may still be a part of the group but is going solo in the US also. And this is Tiffany Young who uh, released her debut music video for the US uh, two days ago now. Uh, the song is called Born Again. I'm very intrigued to see what it's going to be like. Is it going to have the K-pop feel? Is it going to have a very US feel? I'm intrigued. Um, I have done previous Girls' Generation uh, music video reactions. I'll card one of them up here for you all. Um, but I'm intrigued to see what happens with the solo because I haven't seen a Girls' Generation solo except from the subgroup of OGG which I will also card up here for you all um but yeah i'm intrigued to see what this video is going to be about so this is tiffany young born again mv reaction let's do this tiffany young some nice visuals we're we gonna start or there we go how is it? It's all in English. Ooh. Her voice is really, really nice. <coughs> I'm not too sure about that mic. Sounds really kind of rusty. She's really pretty though. Ooh, that's older. <laughs> I suppose it's very much like a sort of a Western, uh, Western music video. It doesn't feel like um, a K-pop music video. Well, I can. In English though, I don't know. Girl, that dress looks expensive. You get it wet. You won't get your money back. Oh, I like this. Sepia something. Okay, interesting. Quite like this. Wait, is that a different dress? Oh, I don't know. Hmm. So yeah, that definitely wasn't what I was expecting. It is very Western, I find. Um, it doesn't kind of give me much of the sort of K-pop feel, uh, not just because it's not uh, in Korean with it all being in English, but the video itself, it's got kind of the visuals, but it's kind of very simple in the way in which it looks, which is, is kind of nice in a way, in, like, in the difference from what I'm used to with uh, K-pop stars. But definitely took me aback and clearly made me think about the fact that they must have had, in general, a big budget because that dress was amazing and it's just destroyed now. Like it, I, I don't know why, but I'm really focusing in on the fact that I think it just shows how cheap I am. But they, they are not going to get their money back for that at all. That's just money down the drain. Um, <laughs> But I really enjoyed the song. It was it was an interesting song. I really kind of liked the lyrics. Um, I'd definitely say it's kind of like a love song of some kind. Um, I didn't really pay attention too much to the lyrics. I was kind of paying more attention to the visual, if you can't tell from the fact that I keep thinking, even now, about the fact that that oh, so much money gone on that dress. On both dresses, actually, in fact, which I only realised there were two different dresses at the end. But... Anyway, um, I think the only thing I have against the song is for the chorus itself. I mentioned this a little bit in the reaction. There was kind of something about, in the chorus, kind of the background music. It sort of drowned out her voice a little bit. It was kind of hard to hear what she was saying. And it sounded really kind of, you know, when you, if you 
listening to music on Bluetooth is kind of like a disruption. Or, so, or even like on the radio and you go um, through a tunnel or under a bridge and kind of gets staticky. It kind of felt a little bit like that in the background. It felt really sort of tinny and like there was something wrong with the backing track for the music video. I don't know, it just it kind of irritated me a little bit. Like I enjoyed the rest of the song. It was literally just that chorus part when that strangeness kind of came in and the rest of it was really really great the chorus I think just kind of has let this song down for me I am sorry Tiffany I really did love it and I do love your voice you do have a really nice voice but I think the chorus took away from how good your singing voice is for me um that's not your fault that's uh, at the music producer's fault because they'd be the person who was dealing with this but um yeah it's it's interesting I'd I'd I, other than Jay Park, I literally haven't seen a um, US debut. I think Esna maybe has done one as well, I'm not too sure. Uh, Megan Lee also, but she didn't have too much of a big K-pop um, career. But anyway, I haven't seen too many, so I, it was exciting to see another one. And I'm intrigued to see what else she brings out. I haven't listened to if there's an album that goes with this song, um, but I kind of want to now. But yeah, overall... Tiffany Young, Born Again, really good song. Chorus does let it down, unfortunately. And I feel like I need to listen to the rest of her stuff. And I also um, found out before doing this, like after reaction, um, that she has a, had other K-pop related solo music. So I need to check those out as well. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions for some of her solo stuff, do let me know in the comment section down below. And for Girls' Generation in general, is there a video that you guys want me to react to? also leave a comment down below but what do you guys think of this music video do you think it was it was good did you really enjoy it or do you have the same thoughts about the chorus with me uh, as me or do you think the song actually wasn't that great and are you looking forward to the rest of tiffany young's us debut kind of thing let me know in the comment section down below but you know what thank you guys so much for watching this video i really do appreciate it uh the link to the mv for tiffany young is in the description box down below i'm not gaining anything from doing this reaction so you know please do not monetize this video youtube i'd really appreciate it but um yeah so the link to that is in the description box below there's also the link to my instagram and my patreon where on instagram you can see what's going on in my daily life and patreon you can get early access to any and all of my videos as well as have a say what comes out in future here on youtube however if you're not subscribed go to the button down below or click the one popping up here on screen if you want to check out my previous k-pop reaction videos the playlist will be popping up here and then one of my girls generation reaction videos will be popping up here but again guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all next time.